Hey what's up guys, long time no see, hope all is well. Today I have a brand new video for you all discussing some freshly discovered data mine items that may possibly be arriving in the atomic shop at some point in the near future. We have a pretty interesting selection coming up so with that being said, let's get into it. First off we have a variety of headwear to choose from. From what we can see here we have a vault Tech security riot helmet, a vault Tech cap in white, the Far Harbor Lobster Trap Helmet, Piper's News Cap from Fallout 4, a Military Beret, a Headband with Feathers, and two hats on the top left and bottom right I don't know the official names for. I'm sure someone will enlighten me in the comments as they've done in the past, so thank you in advance. As far as attire, it appears Kate's corset is something planned to be released. We have a cowboy outfit I mentioned in my first ever Atomic Shop video, what seems to be a casual business suit, a vault variation of the white shirt and jeans, and two new jumpsuits showing off the Watoga Civic Center and Robco logos. I really have a thing for the jumpsuits in this game, so I'll be keeping an eye out for those. We also have the iconic leather jacket Piper from Fallout 4 is seen wearing, which I'm sure some are excited to see, as well as a clean and different colored variation of what seems to be the amusement park worker outfit. And last but not least, the vault Tech rep outfit from Fallout 4. Moving on to future armor skins that may be coming out, we have a Nuka Cherry colorway that can be applied to leather, raider, and combat armor pieces. So if you enjoy your Nuka Cherry T51B skin, chances are you'll love this too. For unreleased weapon skins found so far, it seems we have a Garahan themed skin for the Western Revolver, a new Croquet Mallet skin with nails protruding out of it, and camouflage skins for the shotguns. Starting with our first new camp items, we have a variety of new framed paintings to decorate your home with. A nice selection of abstract, rural, and portrait pieces in vibrant colorways to please your inner artist. Here we have a new selection of doors that may be coming soon, one brandishing the vault Tech logo on the front. Kinda like this, I feel they'd go nicely with metal builds as not many of the existing doors really complement them. They just seem out of place, so these would be a nice addition honestly. Like the Collectron, but wish it had a bit more style or a bit more class? Well, you're in luck with what seems to be a gold or bronze and silver model coming soon, as well as a raider themed variant, if you really want everyone to know that you're a horrible person. Following up, we have a new rug for your home. It, it's still dirty, but you've never seen it before, so it's new to you. Looks like they're getting into the Christmas spirit with the bows and mistletoe on the mailbox and trash bin. These are all accompanied by a marble vault Tech logo statue in case you're really into that vault Tech branding with your build. And last but not least, a new selection of flooring soon to come so you can trick out your home's interior. That olive green one in the middle seems to be military themed. I'm guessing by the use of the stars, so I wonder if anything is supposed to release with it. Guess we'll have to wait and see. Well, that wraps up another quick video. What are you guys excited for? Anything you may want to grab as soon as possible, or are these items a pass for you? Let me know in the comment section below, I'd love to read them. I know it's been two months since I've posted, so I wanted to come back with something simple so I can get back into the groove of things. If you found this video to be enjoyable, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Fallout 76 content like this in the near future. Also, check out some of the previous Future Atomic Shop videos I've made, as there's still plenty of items covered that haven't been released yet. And until next time guys.